So guys, I thought I'd bring you people a uh, tour of my room of requirements, the way I've got it set up, which in my opinion is absolutely amazing and the best way to do this. I'll also showcase to you guys how you can open up the room, expand more rooms and everything you need to know about this place. Okay, so the room of requirements is your home within Hogwarts Castle. It's where you come to basically do everything in the game i mean like if you want to upgrade gear through potions craft uh, discover gear uh, bring your your tames your base farm them i mean this is the place for it now to actually get to this place guys you need to do professor weasley's room of requirements uh, quest which is about between the 10th and the 15th main story quest line once you get that out of the way you'll get a quest line for deke open up could the elf the knapsack and the loom uh, complete all of these quests, just follow the actual progress of his quests and you'll end up with his last mission which is the uh, Phoenix Rising mission which unlocks the fourth and final room which is that one up there especially for that Phoenix. Now some of his quest lines are tied to the main story progression uh, and level so if you're if you've just passed one of his quests you've just completed one of his quests and nothing else has popped up yet progress the main story guys and eventually will okay so my room of requirements as you enter this beautiful area i got a christmas tree there i don't know why it's like trees uh, i just think it matches the uh the varying behind it as well with the trees so i've got that there on my right hand side here i've got three different knights in different sizes i've got my loom there which uh, you upgrade your gear on i've got again three knights behind this uh thingy which is the identification station which identifies gear Three more uh, knights there looking badass and three more knights there looking badass. Nice and simple. Another thing I did as well, guys, is I took down all the uh, pictures off the walls. I absolutely hate clutter. I hate those chairs, those old looking chairs and tables and rugs. I got rid of absolutely everything. There ain't a picture in sight here. I've got nothing hanging on my walls, which is the way I like it. Um, that's your ambient look, I believe, is... I can actually showcase I, I think it's like the room's it won't be the one here of so course. I'm gonna have to change it to see what it was what so if you like this look I think it's like the uh no it isn't the eerie one no it's not the dark and mysterious one so if I change to warm and cozy like I'm gonna do it you can skip this by spamming hmm. all them buttons bam just like so but this isn't my main room my other main room I'll showcase here which is absolutely badass which we'll come to in a second you'll love that you'll love that I don't see I don't like it like this it just looks too too clean i mean hey it's obviously just my opinion the way i like things but it's too clean like i'm a slave room i'm pure room. blood i like that darkness okay so the one i was using was this one a cool moonlight ambient sounds perfect that's the one and this is the one i have come on dig get your groove on oh yeah there we go i think it looks badass it looks badass okay so now my main room is this one right here where all my crafting goes on and it's down here. Now this room will eventually open up for you but it gets much 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 bigger upon you completing the game or defeating the last main mission of defeating Ramrock which I do believe is this quest right here. Let me showcase this to you guys because there's obviously missions after you defeat the last boss which is that one there. I need to be level 34 to get to it. It's in the shadow of could be revelation no it's not revelation yes it's in the shadow of a revelation after you complete this guys this whole area here for me anyway opened up and you can see right again another christmas tree i like my christmas trees people again i got a night guard in the door that side i got a night guard in the door that side and in here i have absolutely everything pretty cool guys all my uh my growing tables different plants i got all the large ones here as well Come on, give me that cabbage. There's so much. So much for me to do. Come on now. Come on now. Give me all this goodness. Give me all this goodness. So these are my potting stations. We have my potion stations here, which I haven't really done anything with yet. Just this here just looking cool. Just looking cool. These little dudes here uh, brew me a random potion yeah, every 12 minutes. So every 12 minutes here, I get a random potion. These are my moonstone uh, refineries. Give you 10 moonstone every 10 minutes. You can have a max of three of them here. Here, guys, we have uh, the fertilizers every four minutes. You add the fertilizer to your plants, obviously. 
And these things here, guys, these give you... I actually can't remember what these are called. Let me pull up my thing. But if I just go to do this. These are... Are they potion? Uh, plant thingies? Yes, they are. Oh, yeah. So what these will do is they give you a random plant uh, ingredient. A scientific study chopping station that periodically produces a plant ingredient. Much like what we see with the... Um, the potion things here they will give me a random plant every i think it's like five minutes maybe it could be it actually it could be 12 minutes same as these be 12 minutes i'm not certain on that but yes guys this is my my room requirement i know where i've got it set up now i am in the process of doing my vivariums i just gotta unlock more things so i can play around in there but i like my things looking nice and neat three more statues there guys three more uh knights there I do like my things looking nice and neat. So yeah, this is the way you got to do it, guys. No clutter, no tables, everything in order, everything nice and straight and neat. This is what we got to do. But yes, guys, that is my room of requirement for those that are wondering about it. Not the best. I mean, I'm, I'm curious to see everybody else's designs. I mean, like the way you've got it all set up. Let me know if you want to share your images with me on my Discord. That is linked down below. Uh, I'd love to check it out. I'd love to see what you've got. I'd love to get that inspiration. But yes, guys, this is my room of requirement and how I've got it set up. In my opinion, the best way to set it up. Nice and neat with everything. Everything easy to access. Not everything like a jumbo sale or a car boot. Everything's all over the place. I can't stand that shit. But there we have it, guys. Guys, if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see, I want. Oh, there's a rug. How did I miss that rug? Hey, mommy's done. But yeah, guys, if you do enjoy the video, leaving a like really helps out. If you like what you see and want to see more Hogwarts Legacy, be sure to subscribe. And hopefully, guys, I will see you on that next one.